Once again, from our studios in Rockefeller Center, Jane Paul. Good evening. The president is urging America to get back to normal. In honor of that, Dateline returns to its original format of frivolous, inane, tedious segments under the guise of news. <laughs> Join us tonight as Dateline investigates reality television. You'll never believe what we found. <laughs> My investigation into the origins of reality programming started here at NBC Studios in Burbank, California. I caught up with NBC's vice presidents in charge of special programming and retirement gifts, Jim Westerman and Jan Dore, at the soundstage where NBC sitcom Emerald is taped. <laughs> <laughs> With the live studio audience in place, I stole a few moments before the taping was to begin. Jim, Jan, Jane, good evening. That's horse crap, and you know it! Damn you. This interview is over. <clears throat> That's done. Please, please, I, I haven't even asked you a question yet. <clears throat> Okay, then, ask your question, <laughs> but we have a taping. <laughs> You've got a great crowd tonight! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Isn't it true that network executives are so creatively starved that they're being forced to turn to these cheap, schlocky reality shows like Lost and Dateline just to fill out the schedule? Uh, Jan, take this. All right. That is horse crap. But, but yes, Jane, you're right. Don't think for a minute that our jobs aren't absolutely crucial to this network, you know? <laughs> it's not like we get these ideas from a, from a, a crazy bum out in the back alley behind Studio 4. <laughs> Strange as it may seem, a crazy pea-stained bum is exactly who NBC and all the other network executives go to for their reality show ideas. He lives right here in this alley. And I've come to... Hey, son of a bitch! No! No! Not happening to me! No! 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 Not me, victim! I, son of a bitch! Eat me, you bastard! As I was saying... Thanks for the help, guys. As I was saying, this alley is home to just such a crazy, pea-stained bum. And his name is Reggie Chester. So, Mr. Chester... Uh, my friends call me Reggie, even the cops. <laughs> oh, God, man, what have you been drinking? Uh, nothing, no, that's the smell of decaying teeth. <laughs> uh, so, Mr. Chester, if you had invented all these reality shows, surely I would have heard of you by now. Well, I'm the network's dirty little secret, you know. And I thought that was David Spade. <laughs> You're insane. Uh, really? Someone who invented Temptation Island or Love Cruise or the homoerotic boot camp insane? <laughs> yes, that would be my definition of insanity, yes. Uh, oh, well, then, touche, ça gueule bleu, I don't know. And as I watched Reggie urinate on my remaining shoe, I couldn't help but think I'd still rather watch that than Love Cruise. <laughs> For Dateline, I'm Jane Paul.